He's in a hurry. He's expressing, you know, that I got it clean. When he gets to work, he's ready to get started. And he always knows that it's time, because he'll say it's time to get started. So he'll let me know, you know, I'm ready to work. And at the end of the day, he'll let you know, he, he knows that it's time to quit. Having Todd at the school is awesome. We love him, the kids love him, and his energy is everything. We love his energy. He will do whatever he can to make the situation work. Todd, a real good friend. I mean, to know Todd and know how he react, you got to learn how he is. After you get to know Todd, I mean, he's the best person. I mean, he's no better than me or you. He knows what he's doing. I mean, he's a real good person. Mr. Todd has um, a barrier with communication. And so that barrier can sometimes make it hard for you to understand, but not impossible. Now, just because he's nonverbal, I would like to clear the air alone. That doesn't mean he's not intelligent. Todd is very intelligent. He's very thoughtful. He cares about other people. What's your favorite thing to do? Mm. Todd loves to make sure that all the rooms are clean. He goes back and checks twice to make sure everything is off the floor. I think he loves to make sure he did a perfect job. Oh, he always, you know, expresses to me that he drove today. The day that he used the buffer, he always lets me know that he drove. He cares about his job, he cares about his work, and he wants to be great. And so to see Todd working and sanitizing, Todd does a great job wiping things down, making sure that his favorite thing, I believe, is the floors, because he's always telling me, he's doing the floors. So when you do the thumbs up, that means it's okay. He'll let you know he's working on the floors. He'll point to the floor. He's just awesome. And what he does with the kids is everything. They love to help him out. They don't want to be left out without Todd. They want to push his garbage can for him. They want to sweep for him. They want to get his brooms, dustpan, whatever. Whatever. He greets the kids because when he gets here at 3, the kids don't leave until 3.45. So he watches them, you know, from a distance and waves. They wave at him. They say, hi, Mr. Todd. You know, when they get ready to get on the bus, he'll wave bye-bye. He always, you know, speaks to the kids. He always go like this, let me know that they're small, so. <laughs> when I look at my kiddos that are in special education and I look at Mr. Todd, I want them to see that anything is possible. I want them to see that they should not ever let anything stop them from accomplishing the goal that they've set out to do. And that's any kid, that's anybody, even adults, we can look at Mr. Todd and learn something. But for my children that may um, look at Mr. Todd and see themselves, they'll have an opportunity to see, I too can do whatever it is I'm set out to do. He's saving lots of money. so he can buy him an RV, so he can ride, and while his dad drive, he wants to ride and sleep. He said he's gonna cook in the RV. Where do you wanna go? You gonna sleep, you just wanna drive? He talks about driving, just taking trips, and he always said he's gonna sleep, and always lets me know that his father will do the driving. Are you saving money, Top? He said he's stacking it up. He's so fast. You know, he doesn't like to be slow about doing anything. He runs. When he takes out the garbage, he runs to the dumpster. And he runs back and he laughs at me because I can't catch him. So he, he likes to do everything in a hurry. <laughs> time is very important to Todd. He always likes to do things on time and matter. If I'm not here, Todd got it. He can handle this. He can do anything you ask him to do. He gonna make sure it's clean. Every room, he gonna miss a room. If you can't clean all of them, he gonna do it. But I'm looking for an employee. I'm looking for somebody dependable, a fast learner, come to work on time, and do the job 
and don't miss no days. And that's Todd. And that's how Todd is. It really is. Everybody deserves a chance. Just give them a chance. Give them a chance. Just, they, they just want one chance. With people that have disability, you got to give them a chance. Because everybody have different things they can bring to the table. If you give them that one chance, I promise you, you would not regret it. Because they're going to make some of the best work that you could have. They too have value. It's just, are we willing to accept who's bringing that value?